It's an honour, it's a privilege to be able to do even this, this great tradition, especially when we're talking about two wonderful people. Enjoy your lives together and continue to do things as a couple, as a partnership. If you want to go fast, go alone. If you want to go far, go together. Ellen, you're a kind and generous person, a beautiful daughter, a loyal sister, a wonderful aunt, a niece, cousin, granddaughter, and you'll make a brilliant wife. You work hard and you play hard and you like to push yourself. Your mum and I are very proud of you. So carry on, make it count, and carry on being the brilliant daughter that you are. I love you. Laken, you truly are a brother to me. I wish you and your beautiful wife, Ellen, <laughs> a life of happiness and the kind of growth that you can only really feel by truly loving another. Laken's always a very positive person. He only sees the positive in everything and everyone. Always friendly, always thinks the best is coming. We're delighted to have you as our son-in-law. And I want to thank you for making Ellen so happy with everything you do for her. I call upon these persons here present to witness that I, Ellen Rose Johnston, do take the Laken Rowan Vincent Brown to be my lawful wedded husband, to have and to hold from this day forward, for better, for worse, for richer, for poorer, in sickness and in health, to love and to cherish, till death do us part. Ellen, I give you this ring as a sign of our marriage. With my body, I honour you. All that I am, I give to you. And all that I have, I share with you. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. There are no great people, just ordinary people who've done great things. And uh, you've already done that, and you will go on to achieve even greater things. Thank you for being my greatest purpose. Throughout our lives, I promise to show no fear from the challenges that present themselves. I will always be a shoulder for you to cry on. A fearless pillar that is only scared of one thing, and that is that life will not be long enough. That is why I treasure the gift of living that you give. I know that from the happiness you offer, to the hardship we endure, and to the achievements we endeavor, all things are desired as long as we do them together. You make me better than I ever imagined to be. The image of life you gift 
is what I am still trying to mirror. You are my answer to everything unanswered. In life, the irrelevant is not necessary now that I have you by my side.